Okay, next we're going to look at the lateral skull. Uh, this position is a little bit different. You're going to have a, a collimated field of view that's more of a crosswise field. Most of you are using DR now, but uh, the, the orientation of the light field should still be crosswise. This one, we're going to rotate the patient. We'll be doing a right lateral to have their right side against the board. And the IOML should be parallel to the floor. And then we're, we're going to make the interpupillary line perpendicular to the upright bucky. Um, things that are going to be a little bit more uh, difficult to spot here is going to be tilt and rotation. So we're going to take some extra time during the initial positioning to try to eliminate those. Uh, so Mr. Patient, sir, can I have you back up just a little bit? And we're going to turn you to the left. And now we're going to slide you towards the board there. All right. Okay, and then I'm going to have you turn and look straight at that door. I'm going to rotate your head a little bit. We're going to try to lean you in towards the board. All right, and we're going to try and keep your neck vertical. So come away just a little bit. I'm going to turn your head a little to the left. Keep going. And then let me have you bring your chin down. Tuck your chin in just a little bit. Keep going. Keep going. Right about there. So there's our IOML parallel to the floor. Central ray should be about two inches above the EAM. I'm going to slide you back just a little bit. Oh, too far. Right there. So I'm getting up at the top looking for rotation left to right. I'm going to fix that just a little bit here. I'm also looking for tilt where the top of the head goes to the right or to the left. Looks like we got a little bit. I'm going to turn your head, just tilt it a little to the left right there. Check my light again, and I'm going to line up my bucky now. I think we're good there. And because this is a right lateral, I'm going to mark the anterior border here with the right marker. And we can collimate a little. We need the frontal bone to the top of the skull to the mastoids at the bottom. You take this on suspended respiration and you can relax.